welcome back to the channel today we have a 23 Tesla model 3 here and one defect that we see on this car is that this door seems to be delaminated or it got some heat somehow that's your charging port door and we got the complete replacement assembly right here that we are going to install nice clean first thing pop your trunk let's pull this plastic top part away and on there is a clip on both sides let's undo these clips so we can pull this side cover now that you have that plastic trim removed there's two clips like this rest of it pushes in pull the carpet back here's a light connector here for you the one connector the white connector the black one connects to this other one here the white connector that is connected to the module somewhat right there already have unblocked it but in order for you to get it out you have two clips locking it in from the bottom that you have to push and pull the bottom part out and the top one just kind of hooks behind the frame uh, or body panel but this motor here is big enough that you're not able to pull it out unless you remove the tail light so let's go ahead and remove this tail light behind here you find two eight millimeter nuts here and here on top here you have a trunk lead like in the pump stop I took vice grips and got it loose and now I'm just gonna undo it by my hands there we go and let's see if that's gonna wiggle off now and here it is one connector in the back that our daylight is removed you will find three 10 millimeter bolts holding the housing for the backing of the charging cables you have to unbolt these then you're gonna go ahead and pull the whole housing far as far as you possibly can to get this door out I'm gonna need two hands to actually get it out and you gotta feed this rubber block through there we go pushing there we go and now I need my two hands one is gonna pull away this charging cables whatever piping here to get this door slided out just like this our old door motor lead everything else is removed and you're gonna go ahead and do a reverse install on the new one just be careful not to mess up your paint best way would be if you go ahead and tape these areas here to avoid any paint damage again you have to pull this packing of these cables or piping away to be able to slide and feed your wiring through that hole and pull this rubber through the hole and push in rest of the mechanism new one is going in don't try to start it from here try to already slide it in from this area here it's gonna be easier now we're gonna go ahead and fit it here under here we see those two locking clips but first you want to go ahead and get this upper upper edges properly stuck under the body panel new door assembly bolted in not bolted but locked in I'm gonna grab my connector pull the wiring through and the rubber grommet connector reconnected now it's time to reinstall our three ten millimeter long bolts just before reassembling everything making sure our charge port door is operating as it should let's see let's click the open charge pump and close everything seems to be working has no obstructions there we go now we can go ahead and reinstall our tail light 
plug our wiring connector back in daylight is reinstalled connector back in we're done in the back here our grommet is pulled through and is the way it should be we have a light connector here that's about it on this carpet now it's time to tuck this carpet back behind this weather strip on the trunk side here once we are done with this we're gonna go ahead and reinstall this plastic just like this job is done doesn't cost you anything to hit the subscribe button like and leave a comment and help this channel to grow for more videos that will help others out